Good morning, good morning, good morning, guys. How's your day going so far? Ours is going pretty well. We haven't done very much, but how do you feel about today, Aspen? I have a lot of stuff to get done. Okay, I need to like sit up and not look so ugly. You don't look ugly. You're so beautiful. I'm trying to get done my video for this week, and then we also need to film. I just have a lot of videos like pre film before we leave and like get married and stuff. It's a lot of stuff to get done in a short amount of time. We uh, might go past uh, our house again. Also, we hit 800,000 subscribers. That is so crazy. That's insane. That's literally insane, guys. Thank you guys so much. I swear we just hit like 400,000. Where were we? We were driving to Vegas. That was just the last time we went to California. Really? We were driving, we hit, we hit 700. Six, no, oh, we, 700, we hit 700,000. That was like two, three weeks ago though. That's insane. That's crazy, guys. Thank you guys so much. So Parker is about to try his fake chicken nuggets he bought in a vlog the other day. And we are gonna film Aspen trying them. Uh-uh, I don't want to. So here you go. That's not part of the plan. Here's your bite. No, babe, I really don't want it. All right, they Does definitely- It tastes like chicken. Mm. Definitely doesn't taste like chicken. I don't know. They're not the best, but they're they're <laughs> not the worst, so I could eat them. Parker also is eating some of my pasta, but he didn't put any sauce in it. That's weird. So I've been editing like all day long. Now we're gonna like take a break for a little bit and go and run some errands. And we have to take Bean with us because all my siblings are at school and my mom just left and yeah, so. She's not very happy about it, so we're gonna have to buy him a treat at Costco to get him to cooperate. We're gonna go drive by our house, we have to stop at the post office, we have to stop at the mall, and we have to... Why are we going to Costco? Oh yeah, we have to see about getting pictures printed for our wedding. So we have a couple stops to make. Mm. Three minutes later, Parker has decided he is not going I to ate them all. finish his plate of chicken nuggets. I ate them all. And he requested a piece of pizza and a smoothie from Costco. Should we go there first? Yeah, Should we go back around this way instead of this way? If we're going to Costco anyways, why don't I just get some food from there? You know what I mean? Instead of having to gag down that food, <laughs> get some food that I'll actually like. I think I've, I don't know if I've had the chicken before. Maybe I have, and I swear it tasted like real chicken. It was probably like five years ago though, but I didn't think it was too bad. I had something else though, I swear. Maybe it was the bacon, and that did not taste real. The bacon from where? Um, that same company, whatever it's called. Okay, we're in the car with Bean. Are you excited to be running these errands? No, help me. We're about to drive by the house. This is the moment of truth. I think the frame is Framing is either gonna start today or tomorrow, so this is gonna be our reactions. And the we anticipation see it, is killing me, guys. <laughs> I just want it to get started. Yeah, yeah, how, yeah, this is seriously like the worst thing ever. Just I like just want them to start feeling so it. anxious to see it be done or started at least. I had a feeling that it would. I feel like I just have like bad luck, and so I didn't think. There it is! Look at that, babe. Be Bean, that's our house. It's so cool! I know, how exciting, huh, Bean? Bean, tell everyone about your vines. Follow. Yeah, Follow and stuff. Bean, why do you have long hair now? Because you think it's cool? Yeah. It is. Only 2.30, I guarantee by the end of the day, it's all gonna be framed. Not like, think. not like the wood. the wood, not like that, The not the sheets of wood, but it'll probably have all the frame, like the two by fours up. We'll drive back tonight. I'm just excited to walk through it and have it yeah. make more sense. Be able to like walk through Cause it through just seems so tiny and like it's, I mean the house, it's a one story house, but it's not tiny, it's like four bedroom, you know? But like with any house that just has the concrete pad, you're like, there is no way this is it. So I'm really excited. We'll go back later How tonight. exciting is that though? I can't believe it. Check out this beautiful TV. You might need to get an 80 in. That's expensive. Mm -hmm. 75 is like a whole thousand dollars cheaper. But I guess that is kind of significantly smaller, a little bit. I mean like that much money, but think of all the good times we'll have with that <laughs> with TV. With our TV? Think about that. I don't know. Those are memories that will last forever. Is it recording? Yeah. 
Oh. 65 inches. You should buy that. Right now? <laughs> so, As so Aspen told me to vlog and she thought it was gonna be cute. Cute. Just talk. Tell us about your school day. No. Why? Because and then your big black, we're looking. It's be fun to watch movies. They're mostly there. looking for like TVs. And these pictures are freaking amazing. And they have red rolls. We at the Costco food court getting food. Parker's really funny because he gets really nervous to order food for some reason. Like I told him to get two pieces of pizza and two berry smoothies and a frozen yogurt. Simple order, and I went to walk away, and he was like, "No, babe, come back." <laughs> He always gets nervous to order food. I don't know why. I haven't had Costco food in so long. Costco has the best pizza, the best smoothies, the best ice cream, the best everything. So Parker's running in to the mall. We had to get the other part of my ring resized. And I was like, oh my gosh, it's going to be so cute. I can't wait to try it on. And then I remember that I forgot to wear it. I suck at that. I feel like I get better and then I get worse. I don't know how I forget. I just keep it like in my bathroom. Oh, people also always ask me like, why do I even take it off? I'm like really paranoid about like scratching it or ruining it or something so I take it off like when I sleep I take it off when I shower I take it off when I go to the gym usually so I have to, so I take it off like a lot just because I don't want it to like get messed up and I keep it in my bathroom and if I don't get ready for the day then I don't usually like go in there so I forgot to wear it today but yes it's uh my wedding band um he's getting that resized and it was kind of funny because when we got my engagement ring resized they charged us like 20 bucks or whatever so we're like oh cool yeah and then parker went the other day to take in the wedding band and the lady was like okay it's gonna be 45 dollars and he was like uh no and he was like you guys charged me 20 like a month ago and then she was like oh yeah it's 20 <laughs> so yeah that was kind of funny oh my gosh i'm so mad i forgot to wear it also, this is my outfit for the day. My little secret for getting ready slash not getting ready is instead of just wearing like sweats or something, just wear gym clothes because then people are like, oh, she didn't get ready because she just went to the gym or she's going to the gym. But really, <coughs> you're not. You feel me? Bean, do you like having bangs? Hmm? Do you like having bangs? Yeah, are bangs like these? Yeah. Let me see your forehead. <laughs> I'm really mad. Why? Because I can't see my forehead. <laughs> <laughs> Last night in my family, we had like a giant group message because, uh, oh, we didn't vlog yesterday. We went to Target with Ruger and Meg, and Meg found this like skeleton thingy. And then she was like, chocolate! Like on SpongeBob when that old skeleton lady is like, you know the episode where they sell chocolate and so then we had like a giant family group message because i sent the picture to my family and then we all sat there and like quoted spongebob for like an hour the classic episodes of spongebob are the best huh bean what do you think is the best like what's the best episodes of spongebob probably the old ones yeah like the ones where, like the ones where they sell chocolate <clears throat> yeah and like the first one i like that one what's the first one like the one where they're cavemen no which one the one where <clears throat> Spongebob goes and does Krusty Krab and he has a sword and stuff. What? Yeah, the one where they sell chocolate. The one, oh, the one where Gary only wants to hang out with Patrick because he has a cookie in his pocket. Hey, <clears throat> Did what? you know Gary and Patrick are cousins? Oh yeah, when Gary becomes, when Patrick becomes a king or whatever, but then Gary actually is. Yeah, they're cousins. Patrick That's and cool Gary. Bean. The one where SpongeBob loses his his identity. <laughs> that one's funny. His license. Or oh, his his ID tag. or whatever. Or his name tag. Yeah, his name tag. And then they like reenact his day. The magic conch one. That one's <laughs> funny, Bean. When the thing like floats across the sky and then that guy's like, make Can a wish, honey. Can you say anything else but no? <laughs> Let's see. Alrighty. I have to put it on and then go put on the other part. You told them that I just, that we were what we were doing? Yeah. Just got the wedding band resized. Put it on me. Let's yes, see me if you. it fits. Say I do. I do. Does it fit? Yep. Gotta go. Put on the other half, add it to its brother. Aspen never wears her. I really do, I swear. I'm no, getting better at remembering to wear doesn't. it. I was like, when I went to brush my teeth, I looked at it and I was like, oh, I gotta remember to put that on. 
then I forgot. All right, mom, tell us about all your stuff. So I'm making dream catchers, and they're gonna be so cute for Ap's wedding. Oh, cute helping. little mom. And then we're gonna put these cute little feathers. Cute mom. And all this cute little stuff. Cute mom. I am editing my new video for the week and I accidentally messed up the color correcting on every single clip and now I literally cannot fix it. Literally. So this is probably gonna look kind of weird. Also, I put this filter thing on it and it makes my roots look like they are literally black, literally. which they are not. I'm about to turn on Avery's favorite music. Oh, I don't know what she's talking about. She's just being really annoying. <laughs> the Kim Kardashian thing. When she's like, literally, Avery, you are being so annoying, <laughs> and she won't shut up. This is Avery's favorite music right here. I'm All right. Me too. Let's see. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> I haven't heard this song in so long. Low key. It's Austin. Oh, and everyone his loves you. And this his is Austin's friend. girlfriend. She says, back off. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> but yeah, Parker told me that I can spray his hair blue. So I'm gonna do it. I think she we're gonna save it. She wants to do it for the wedding. I no, I said I'm gonna save it for after the wedding just in case it like stains or something for some reason. Yes. So yeah, be excited for that. In the next like month or so, we're gonna spray paint Parker's hair blue. Pumpkin hunting. Find us a good one, babe. Babe, this one looks good. Oh. Kinda. Oh. This one is literally perfect. Hey, we'll carve this side. It's kind of flat. <laughs> Wait, what about this? You want this one? Yeah, whatever. Or do we want one with a better stem? I don't care. Look at that stem. Look at that thing. That is a good stem. Hey, we need like quality pumpkin. That one's good. Yeah. <laughs> Look at that one. That one has stuff on it. I'll clean it. Okay. Okay. This one's like perfectly round and a flat spot just for the thing. Cool. We are at our pumpkin carving party. Parker thinks I have no talent, so my job is to be the watcher and make sure that he is doing a good job. She's a watcher. Rigger and Meg are still scraping theirs out. Austin and Cheyenne have scraped theirs out. We're listening to the Pussycat Dolls Pandora Station. Austin's loving it. Parker's it's poking holes. Fine, like we'll this. do the back. So this is Parker's little eye that he poked. All the circles are perfectly spaced apart and there's no area missing. This one is mine <laughs> and it looks really, really not as good as his. I think he finished this part for me. I don't know, maybe he did that part. He did this part of the eye and the nose. We just finished up carving them. Here is mine. Looks like a spooky face if you can see it. And then there's Austin's, an upside down bat. How cool is that? Good. Cool upside down bat. Parker thought I just did upside down, but. Yeah, I thought he messed up and yeah. did upside down, but I guess it's supposed to be hanging upside down. Alrighty guys, we're having a little competition and we need you guys to judge it. Here is the competition. Who has the best pumpkin? So, we will start on this side. This one is Ruger and Meg's. Uh, what is it called again? One-eyed monster with hands. The middle one is Austin and Cheyenne's. It's an upside-down bat. And then the left one is mine and Aspen's. Comment down below. Tell us who you guys think wins. After pumpkin carving, I think we went... Oh yeah, we went to McDonald's. We went with all of our friends to McDonald's, got some food, and that was it. That was the end of the night, guys, so that's it for the vlog. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you guys would like to, you guys can subscribe to us, and all that does is just let you know when we post a new video, which is quite frequently. Also, if you like this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. See you guys tomorrow. Bye.